you know, you know. Put that bad boy right there in the front. <laughs> Let's see what the bathroom looks like in three, two, one. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, y'all. Okay, welcome back to another video. We're back. <laughs> Did you miss me? So anyway, y'all, as y'all can see by the title, today we are doing a bathroom transformation, before and after, because y'all said y'all wanted to see that. So it's only one thing that I can think of. I feel like I can add stuff here and there, but one thing I really, 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 really want in my bathroom that I do not have yet is like a little stand that goes against the wall. I don't know what it's called, but basically like put hand towels on there, regular towels, like for when I have company or, you know, people visit or whatever, like it'd be just easy to, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know what it's called, but I haven't found one yet. And I've been looking for one. So that's the only thing that, that I don't have that I want. So, um, the reason I'm in the kitchen is because I need to do these flowers. I got some eucalyptus back there as well. And then I got some fresh roses, all from Trader Joe's. So if you want some fresh eucalyptus put in the shower, fresh flowers and roses and stuff, go to Trader Joe's. I do have my black vase right here. Um, this is going in the bathroom. I just cleaned the bathroom from top to bottom. I swept, I mopped, I sanitized, I bleached that motherfucker. I did everything. So it's nice and clean and ready to be decorated. Let's go ahead and do these flowers real quick. I'm not about to talk y'all to death. I'm eating watermelon too, so. I keep on falling in. Sometimes I love ya. Sometimes you make me blue. <laughs> So uh, this is the before, okay, everything is nice and clean. I do have my shower caddy already up, but besides that, everything is nice and clean. So let's get started, guys. This is the area right here that I was saying I wanna add like a little something, like a stand or something right here, but I haven't found anything just yet because this bathroom is huge. I kind of want to put something up there, but tell me if that would be tacky, like a big ass vase. You know what I'm saying? Would that be a little tacky, y'all? Am I doing too much with that? But let's get started. So I have this clock, y'all, that I want to put right here. I want to just get it out the way and hang it up real quick. I didn't want to put holes in the wall, but I'm going to have to for this clock. So yeah, this is the clock. I used to have it in my kitchen, but I think it'd be a good addition. I need to wipe it off, but I think it'd be a good addition right there. So hold on real quick. I'm thinking like right here, right here. I think I did pretty good with centering it. Hopefully it looked right. I'm gonna have to stand back and look. I think it looked pretty decent. So let's do the rest of the bathroom. So I got this little tray y'all from Wayfair. I wanna put it right here in the middle like that. And then let me bring y'all closer so y'all can see everything I'm about to put on here. So I have these little jars that I got from Etsy. I think they are so cute. So this is floss. This is um, cotton balls. And then these are Q-tips. So I'm gonna just sit them right here for right now. I think they are so cute. Ah! Okay, I have a black paper towel holder. I'm gonna put it right here. I'm gonna bring these a little closer to the front. 
on it. Then I have this Aries candle, y'all. I'm obsessed with myself, obviously, so we're gonna set that right there. And just to add a pop of something, this elephant I already had um, at my old crib, so I got this little elephant that I'm gonna add, and I'm gonna put that right there. And last but not least, we're gonna add our flowers. Oh, that looks so cute, it looks so cute. Let's add the paper towels and see how they look. So these are the paper towels. Okay, okay. Oh, we're gonna light the candle just for the sake of the video. <laughs> I think this looks so good. Let me show y'all. All right, y'all, so, so far, this is what the candle tray looks like. I kind of wanted to put the candle a little further away because I don't want the fire to kind of like burn the flowers. So I try to put it like in the corner, but still say, baby, that's that Aries candle, okay. I got the candle from a TJ Maxx. These are from Etsy. Elephant, I've been had. Vases from TJ Maxx. Flowers, Trader Joe's, paper towel. <laughs> holder from Amazon. So the next thing I have is my black trash can, which I got from Amazon. And then this is my um, tissue paper holder. So they both gonna go side by side next to the toilet. I'm gonna put trash bag in here. I have black trash bags too, y'all. I'm just, <laughs> I'm a little extra, y'all. I also got the trash bags from Amazon. You love me. Change your plane, change the weather. And I promise for it. I like to put a knot on mine. Because I don't like my trash can. As soon as you put something in there, it start falling apart. So, I like to turn it around like this though. Because I don't like the knot to show. This toilet paper, y'all, is too big for this holder. But I'm going to still fit it in there. Because baby, that's what I'm going to do. And boom just like that ain't that so cute though i like that i thought that was different yeah. boom so i did get this white dispenser off of amazon too it's black and i love it i actually gotta get more whites but this will do for now and then i have the poopery <laughs> If you know, you know, you spray this before you take a boo-boo. But I try to get the color scheme, y'all, of my bathroom. Just so extra. So I'm going to just put these back there. I don't know if I'm going to have it open or not. Nah, we're just going to get it closed. And we're just going to put the poopery right there. Very simple. So I got this little hand soap thing from Amazon. I got one in the kitchen, too. But I need to fill it up. So that's what I'm about to do right now. Right now. You gotta make sure you don't overflow it too though because you know you gotta put the thing back in there. Whoa, hopefully I didn't overflow it. Oh, I did it perfect, y'all. Ah, so cute. So we're just gonna sit that right there like that. I do have two sinks, but I don't really use that one, y'all, honestly. Um, I might get another one to put over there. But so far, this is this is good. And I like the fact that you know, the soap in the inside kind of still <laughs> fits the aesthetic. <laughs> Forever. So I'm about to put my shower caddy together. It's already on the wall. I got it from Amazon, y'all. So I just put my soaps and stuff up there. My eucerin, stuff. I got to re-up on my, um, <laughs> my tree hut, but it's something left, y'all. So we are gonna put that right there. These exfoliators I got from Etsy, the lady I was telling y'all. I think I told y'all about Sugar Rose Company or something. So we put that right there. And y'all already know, if you know, you know. Put that bad boy right there in the front. <laughs> okay. And then we're going to put our razor foot thing. So I already put my shower liner and my curtain together. These little, well, I got all of it from Amazon, but I wanted silver. Um, I really was going for silver and black in my bathroom, as you can probably tell. And then like a pop of some kind of color, which is in my rug. 
So, yeah. I already got everything in here. Some of them is falling off, but I'm about to hang it up. It's a mesh at the top. <laughs> and then there's a waffle curtain. I'm going to show y'all at the end, but let me put it up real quick. So as I was saying, it's a net at the top and then it's like waffle at the bottom. It look kind of wrinkled. I made sure I got the extra long one, y'all, because my tub, I want my line, my shower curtain to come all the way down to the bottom. Some people like to show a little tub. I don't, but besides, I might need to steam this. It look a little wrinkled. I'm not sure if y'all can tell how my bar kind of goes like. It doesn't go straight across, so that's probably why I look a little weird with my shower liner. But now I'm about to add the eucalyptus right at the head of the shower line. Boom! Just like that. It don't have to be perfect, but yes, it just looks so good, y'all. It looked kind of weird. How it's angled, but it don't really matter about the top part as long as all of this is gonna hit the water. It's just gonna feel so good when you take a shower, y'all. Trust me. I also got this black um soap dish holder thing, I guess, whatever you call that, from Amazon. I don't like this white one. I wish it wasn't there, but I got that to sit right there for my soap. So that's it for the shower, y'all. I was gonna get one of them things that go at the bottom. But I don't know, y'all. They be looking a little tacky. So I got these towels. I got two racks, y'all. I hope these towels look right with my rug. The rug is going to be the last thing I put in. I'm pretty much done. I don't have a lot going on in my bathroom. But I got these towels. Shout out to Janique, girl, if you're watching my video. Hey, girl. Mm. But she told me to go to Macy's to find some decorative towels, which I just wanted black solid, but I did see these with the little dots on there. And then I, they didn't have any hand towels to put like over top of it. So we're gonna finesse it and try to see if these wash rags will look right over top of it. Cross our fingers. Let me see, I probably think it'll pretty much look the same. I might or might not even do it, but I did want to get the wash rags too because they was on sale, y'all. The towels was only seven dollars and the wash rags was four. For the all of, for all of these, these is only four dollars. So it was like in a backstage department. So yeah, we're gonna put one right here. One right here. On. Okay. Pop the tag off of this. Y'all, I love popping tags off of stuff. Like <laughs> I'm a little obsessed with it. No matter what it is. It don't matter what it is. I just like popping tags, baby. So we're going to fold it. So that it actually fits. And. Yeah. Let's see. Bam. That's the best it's going to look, y'all. Do that look tacky like that? <laughs> so let's do the other one. How that look, y'all? <laughs> All right, we down on the ground now because the last thing I got to do is just put my rug down. But I got a rug um, gripper thing to kind of like stop the rug from moving. So I think it's a little too long though. But let me fix it. So this is too long. I can tell already. So I'm going to cut some of this off. As y'all can see, it's still something I need to cut off. So I'm just gonna line it up with the rug. Actually gonna cut a little more back behind the rug. And I got my rug from Amazon, y'all, in case y'all wanna know. So I got some tape. I want it to kind of be flat though. So I got this tape from Walmart. It's supposed to be two sided. Okay. 
Yeah, just like that, baby. You see that? I like it nice and flat, y'all. Because you don't want to keep tripping over the rug. You know what I'm saying? So let's do the other side, too. Yes, yes, yes. All right, y'all. We all done. Let's see what the bathroom looks like in three, two, one. Right, so this is the bathroom, y'all. This is as best as it's gonna get until I add something right here, which I'll keep y'all posted on. So, y'all already know, got the black trash can, got the tissue paper, toilet paper holder, the wipe dispenser, poopery. I try my best with the towels, y'all. They do look a little off, let me, let me move it down just a little bit. It do look a little off. Okay, got the clock that I told y'all about. And then have my dispenser, the tray, and then the rug I got from Amazon. I might need to adjust the rug because I don't know why it don't look. It look like I need to pull it down more that way. So I might do that. But I also have this little towel area right here, which y'all saw. I mean, y'all see me do everything. So obviously, um, you already know. But then we have the eucalyptus got the shower caddy soap dispenser i might put something back there but yeah that's pretty much it y'all very simple i didn't want too much going on in my bathroom but i will keep y'all posted when i do decide to add like something over here because don't it look like i need something right here y'all just let me know be honest all right y'all so that's it for this video it's really just a bathroom transformation i know it probably was not the longest video but i mean it's not that much <laughs> to really do or show so yeah if you like the bathroom let me know your comments below if y'all have any recommendations on things i can add to kind of you know spice it up a little bit i think it looks nice I think it looks very clean and that's what i was going for so let me know what y'all think and yeah if you have any other suggestions of videos that y'all want to see let me know your girl is moving on to the bedroom next the kitchen is done bathroom is done bedroom is next and then the living room y'all i'm trying to take room by room baby because this shit is expensive so anyway if you like the video give me a thumbs up if you do not like the video give me a thumbs up i appreciate y'all for clicking on that video and i'll see y'all in my next video peace